New information about where convicted rapist Wayne Chapman is now that he's out of prison. His lawyer says Chapman is homeless but not wandering the streets. WBZ's Anaritis Rodriguez explains from Boston. Wayne Chapman is not a danger. Um, I've said this many times. It's been four days since serial rapist Wayne Chapman was released from prison. When released, he had no property, no medications, no identification, not a cent to his name. Well, actually, he did have a few cents. The Department of Corrections gave him a check for nine cents. Now registered as a level three homeless sex offender, the 71-year-old is being monitored at an unnamed medical facility in Boston. When people say he's wandering the streets of Boston or that there are these clubs and gangs of sex offenders, those are lies. Those narratives create false panics. He is listed as homeless because if you have to register in Massachusetts and you don't have a permanent address, you are listed as homeless. He served 30 years for convictions involving child rape and molestation. Deemed too dangerous for release, Chapman had been held in civil commitment since completing his sentence in 2004. In a press conference earlier today, his lawyer says he wants to stop the spread of misinformation and panic. Governor Baker talks about how this was wrong and the system needs to change because it's broken. Um, that creates a panic. That creates a sense that um, this shouldn't have happened when this is exactly the way the system was designed to work. Homeless sex offenders must verify their information with local police every 30 days. Tennant says that Chapman will remain in this unnamed medical facility until he can find a permanent place to live. Reporting in Boston, I'm Anaritis Rodriguez, WBZ News. Anaritis, thank you.